day again and today is a special menu which I'm gonna work with you guys today today I'm gonna do you some Caribbean curry chicken Caribbean curry chicken from Chef Ricardo cooking today remember Chef Ricardo website that code that you can I'm gonna show you how you can cook some lovely Caribbean curry chicken from Chef Ricardo cooking and today I got some nice Irish potato and some spring onion and a large onion and few carrots and two cloves of garlic and I got some olive oil and some everyday seasoning in my everyday season remember I told you in my first video that I got 20 different kind of season in my everyday season and I want to say to you it's so simple curry curry and curry chicken is simple to cook but I always taste when you finish cook it today if you watch my recipe you're gonna taste totally different, you're gonna look totally different from every different Caribbean curry, Caribbean curry chicken. Look how you're gonna cook it. Eat my, uh, my pot, so my pot is on the fire so far. I'm, I'm gonna put about two teaspoons of oil in the frying pan. So I'm doing this at the moment. Then um, what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna remove the bit from the spring onion. And then I'll uh, put on a little heat on my frying pan. The spring onion and the garlic inside the frying pan, as you can see, looking really nice. Just to give it a flavor and a taste, really nice. I'm gonna put a piece of thyme inside of it. Lovely and nice. You can see that beautiful, beautiful, beautiful scent from the spring onion and from the thyme, from the garlic. And what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna put the Caribbean curry chicken inside of the pot. Really nice Caribbean curry chicken from Chef Ricardo today. Beautiful recipe. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna leave this on the fire at least 10 minutes to give it a nice beautiful cooking down. Looking really beautiful. Really nice. As I can see it, looking really nice and beautiful. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna leave this for about 10 minutes and I'm gonna just cover it and leave it, make it go on cooking now for 10 minutes. Guys, I wanna say, with this, with the carbon curry chicken, it's pre own water itself. So, but if you need to add a little water, you can add it to cook the carrot and the Irish potato later on down in the, in the process of cooking the carbon curry chicken you can see the chicken getting there really nice and beautiful you can see the thyme and the spring onion I'll show you one more time again guys look right straight in the pot really nice and beautiful curry chicken curry and curry chicken from Chef Ricardo really beautiful cover it one more time All of the veg which I'm gonna use in that beautiful curry and curry chicken, I'm gonna put a piece more thyme, red pepper, spring onion, thyme, garlic, and some lovely carrot and some lovely white onion and some lovely carrot. This is all of my recipe right here, which I'm gonna put in in my curry and beautiful curry carrot, and some spring onion, some thyme, everything inside of it. Really nice and beautiful. As you can see, what I'm doing right now at the moment, putting everything. I put in the red pepper time then I have some more which I'm gonna put inside of it really nice and beautiful from chef my pepper right here some thyme inside of in the curry curry and curry chicken so what I'm gonna do now I'm gonna put a little bit more of some about half piece of spoon of curry inside of the curry and curry chicken so simple and I'm gonna put some everyday season inside of it just to give it a little bit of flavor really nice and beautiful guys I wanna say you don't need to use salt in this curry chicken you know curry chicken is very easy to season it just get you know you know normal season where you use daily on a basic daily and you can do some nice Caribbean beautiful everyday season inside of your Caribbean curry chicken from Chef Ricardo. This is a nice and beautiful recipe 
exit this is volume one from chef recorder today as you can see just to make life more easy for you guys what i'll do i just boil some water inside of the kettle to pour on top of the curry chicken so what i'm gonna do now i'm just gonna show you i'm just pouring in some boiled water just to make life more easier and i use at least two cups of water inside of the on top of the curry chicken just to give it some beautiful flavor from the full you can see the nice beautiful jamaican beautiful red pepper i want to show you to guys this red pepper come from jamaica straight from jamaica and that british airway and i want to say it is beautiful chicken really nice really beautiful beautiful caribbean curry chicken from chef ricotta today when it finished cook i'm gonna show you how it look like and i'm gonna taste it now just to see how it tastes today from chef ricotta cooking really nice don't need no salt don't need nothing inside of it beautiful chicken from chef ricotta today caribbean curry chicken just to say it is ready and how it look oh my days is looking so beautiful wow oh this one is really nice and beautiful recipe from chef ricotta caribbean curry chicken really nice this is volume one of the caribbean curry chicken i gotta come with the next one caribbean stew chicken and then the next one caribbean stew beef and then the next one caribbean stew pork look out for chef ricotta this video them coming up on youtube live and direct from chef ricotta this is my one of my special recipe as you can see i'm gonna share out it when i finish i make you guys look how food look on the plate when you're gonna eat before you eat it i'm gonna just give you a simple idea of this recipe which i do have right now on my you know on one of my caribbean cooking book really nice recipe this one all you need is some seasoning so all purpose some chicken seasoning a little bit of garlic some spring onion some thyme some red jamaican pepper nice and beautiful fresh and lovely get everything together get some carrot get some irish potato and get everything together first of all you season your meat for 24 hours and after you season your meat to make it soak inside that in that fridge for 24 hours next day you use it put on the frying pan two teaspoon of oil put it on for the pot and leave it and make it give you all of what you need all of your flavors what you need put your chicken in it with some garlic and some thyme and some spring onion beautiful recipe from chef ricardo today as you can see guys this is a beautiful recipe i want to tell you something you're gonna show it look when i put it on the plate in the next couple of minutes from now and remember all you need this process of cooking this caribbean recipe chicken from chef ricardo today less than a half an hour i would say 25 minutes from chef ricardo today recipe yes it is finished lovely and nice and a dish it out really nice and beautiful as you can see even with the red pepper i put it on top of it i got some coleslaw some plain white rice and this is what i'm talking about from chef ricardo with the caribbean curry chicken volume one and remember my website www.co.uk remember youtube twitter and my myspace guys this is a lovely meal and i'm telling you you cannot go wrong if you watch my recipe and my new video which just come out now from chef ricardo volume one caribbean curry chicken look after yourself i see we made the next video with the caribbean stew chicken and i'm gonna show you totally different from chef ricardo